So, Day, how do you feel about performing at the legendary Apollo? Excited. How excited are you? Oh, uh, very excited. Well, shy, but very excited. Okay, so you guys are going to win, right? Uh, y yes. <laughs> so, you are going to touch the wood that so many people touched that went on this stage, like James Brown, Aretha Franklin. How do you feel about actually performing on the same stage with all the greats? Amazing. Like, a lot of pressure, but amazing. I mean, I'm right where they were. Mm, it's... Just amazing for me as a child to be on that stage. It's mind blowing. Is it is it almost like when you was on Radio City, or is it a different feeling? A different feeling, but almost like. It's okay, that's what's up. Okay, brother Malcolm, how do you feel about performing on the legendary stage yeah. of the Apollo? So, like I said, I feel legendary because. I'm on the same stage as so many people are on. I'm rubbing that same log that so many people rub. It's just, it feels fantastic, exhilarating, and I'm just here to kill it. All right, all right. So, if you would choose any of the greats that have touched that same log to perform with you, who would it be? Um, the two that come to mind easily is James Brown and Michael Jackson. Like, Get on the good foot. <laughs> <laughs> that's right, that's right. Yeah, so, like, like, all of this and all of that, like, that's crazy. Yeah. So, you guys are going to kill it tonight, right? Yes, no doubt. That's right, that's right. Yes. All right, man, so, you know, I know you got to get ready for the show. Yes. So, <laughs> holler at the crowd, let them know what time it is. All right, you know it. So, right, Stan. How do you feel about your kids performing on the legendary stage at the Apollo? Um, it is quite an honor. Some of the greatest entertainers in the history have been on that stage. You know, so for my kids to have the opportunity to be on that stage and do their thing, you know, it's, it's amazing. It's an honor. Is it, is it almost like the Radio City or is, is it a different feel? You know, I asked Malcolm the same thing. He said it's totally different. It's totally different. You know, uh, Radio City was, was phenomenal and great in its own right, but still, when you're talking about the Apollo, what it means to, to black folks and, and so forth, that has a bit of a different feel. You know, in fact, in the community, they look at the Apollo as, as, as the venue that you have to prove yourself. So, yes, it's, it's, it's so, totally different. All right, so tell the public what else can we expect from kicking down walls. Uh, the next venue is going to be the Barclays Center, you know, so that would mean we did every major venue except Madison Square Garden, you know, so that's the next step for us. It's the last thing we haven't done. Uh, we look to do that very soon and, you know, go from there. All right. Well, you know, I'm here, brother. I'm always in the back, but you know I'm here with you, so we're going to pop it off tonight and wish KDW all the best and hope that they win. Yes, indeed. Who do you want to shout out today? Shout out to their mom. You know, Mecca, shout out to Virginia, shout out to EVE, you know, those are some of the people that's been in their life, and the entire family, you know, that's been supporting them up until this point in time. Yes, brother. All right, man. We're going to call it a shoot, and we're going to get ready for the kids' performance, and we're going to handle our business as usual. The legendary Apollo, KDW, kicking down walls.